Welcome to SourceFed, I'm Trisha Hirschberger. And I'm Matt Lieberman, and you know what that means. The internet is in an uproar today over the so-called Heartbleed bug, a major vulnerability in the security software used on most websites. Are we panicking? I feel like we should be panicking, Trisha. I'm panicking! Well, you're panicking for sure. Um, everyone should kind of be panicking. Heartbleed is a weakness that allows hackers to steal large batches of personal information, including passwords and banking data, through any website using the popular OpenSSL encryption system. Well, then close the SSLs! Why were they even open? Are they idiots? Come on! Uh, OpenSSL is just the name of the software. For those of you who don't know, OpenSSL is a security system that websites use to transfer and encrypt your passwords and other data. So are my passwords being stolen or aren't they? This is highly confusing. I'm very emotional. Is OpenSSL just broken? Heartbleed isn't a virus or a flaw in the design of OpenSSL itself. However, the websites that are using it may have implemented it improperly. That's why we're vulnerable. I do not like being vulnerable, Trisha. I don't like it. Women love a vulnerable man. Yeah, well, I don't want everyone to know how vulnerable I am. I'm a deeply emotional person. Real men can cry. I can't. Well, there's good news. OpenSSL has released a new version of their software, which fixes the leak. Oh. <laughs> Oh man, good, great. Okay, I mean, why, why didn't we leave with that? Well, because a lot of websites haven't updated OpenSSL, so our data is still at risk. Uh, oh, come on! Is there any way to know what websites are safe? Uh, well, there are, actually. For Google Chrome users, there's an extension called Chrome Bleed, which warns you when you're about to access a website that is still vulnerable to Heartbleed. You can find the link to that in the description below. Well, okay, what if I don't use Chrome? What if I live in the last century? You can use the Heartbleed test site at philippo.io slash Heartbleed. Just enter the URL of the website that you want to test and it will tell you whether or not it's safe to use. Radbatical. So my Netflix queue remains private for another day. I wouldn't be so sure about that, sir. Why? Detection is good, but protection is better. You should probably wait a few days for websites to patch their software, and then after that, you can change your passwords on any of the websites that contain important personal information. Email and bank accounts are a good start. Ugh, I hate changing my password. It feels like saying goodbye to an old dear friend. So long, Matt is great, 27. It's also important to point out that despite the seriousness of the Heartbleed situation, the bug only affects OpenSSL version 1.0.1 .1, and that there have not been any reported attacks, even though the security flaw has been around for two years. Wait, so do I have to change my passwords or don't I? I'm very confused. I would still recommend that you change your passwords, yeah. Now, if you have trouble remembering all your passwords, much like this lady, but you still want to be as secure as possible, you can use a password manager like LastPass or 1Password. These programs add an extra level of encryption to all of your internet accounts. The best part? You only have to remember one password from now on. Your password manager password, but if that gets stolen, you're just but hey man, that's pretty awesome. Now, we want to hear from you. What is the weirdest or dumbest password you've ever used? Let us know in the comments down below. Click the annotation for more source fetty goodness. I'm Trisha Hirschberger. And I'm Matt Lieberman. Matt is great 27, really? It, well, I mean, listen, you need to find self-esteem wherever you can get it. That's true. So you got to produce it. Also, 27 has nothing to do with me, so no one's ever going to guess that. Yeah, right. It's totally your age. Your next password's Matt is great 27. No, I just turned 26. Matt is great 26? No, I'm not going to... I, I don't need to out. change my password again. This is great. It's great, everyone. Good night. Have a have a fun day. I gotta go think of a password. That is great. Twenty six. Shut up.